Hey there, so today I just got a quick demo of the All-Star slash Echo Link interface that I build for the Arcom RC210 repeater controller. So this will interface your repeater controller on um, a separate port, like port 2 or 3, from your main repeater. And uh, you can connect the All-Star Echo Link network, um, plug in and play pretty easily. So um, I've just got it testing here on a Kenwood TKR. This will be whatever repeater you've got on port one. I'm just testing it with Kenwood. I've got the Raspberry Pi with the All-Star Link interface, and that's plugged into port three right here. And then I've just set up all the ports to be linked together, and uh, port three is set up as a non-repeat but full duplex port. I'm passing DTMF also to port three from port one so we can control the All-Star. Um, so without further ado, I just put the All-Star on echo mode real quick to just to demo that for the audio, just to show um, audio going both ways. So I've just, this Pi right now is set up to echo mode. So let me key up on the main channel. You'll see COS and CTCSS lit. And this is W0SKY testing echo mode. Uh, coming in from port 1 on the main repeater, and it's going to echo out from port 3. And now you see uh, COS is lit on port yeah, this 3. This is W0SKY testing echo mode. Uh, coming in from port 1 on the main repeater, and it's going to echo out from port 3. So that's echo mode. I can go disable echo mode really quick. And then um, I can just show you like DTMF commands work. So if I do a star 70, we can get the status. Node 6. Six zero nine zero. Repeat only. What if I do like star three two five six zero? Node two five six zero. Connected to so node on the six. Wind system, six, zero, a popular network. Nine, zero. Um, so that Connect definitely works. Ended. And uh, you could hear some traffic. So anyway, um, that is the All Star interface for the ARCOM RC210 and um, I've set up the audio levels so basically all the ports on TX and RX um, for port 3 are just set to the halfway point on the pot um, the emphasis the jumper should be unset and then the um, level should be set to active high uh, based on the way I set this cable um, so I think that's jumper 9 for active high, the jumper six for uh, no de-emphasis, and then um, the audio levels on both port three input and output pots should be just halfway um, for, for the audio here. Assuming you've set up the rest of the audio um, the way ARCOM has recommended it, I think it's like 1.5 volts peak to peak. The insomniac net meets 